everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel iris budgets in today's video i'm going to be cash stuffing my side hustle income mainly for my etsy shop so in this video i'm going to be cash stuffing from payments i've had for the last like three weeks or so so since i did my last side hustle cash stuffing um so i get paid on a monday from etsy so in today's video i'm going to be cash stuffing 1330 pounds now, 70 of that is a payment that I got, I got £71 something from YouTube and that is for the month of December. So the videos I posted in December and the views that I got, £71 and some change is what I got paid from that. So after tax, I'll be cash stuffing 40 of that into my savings challenges, but the rest of it is going to be invested back into my business. So. Side hustle cash stuffing, if that's something you're interested in, then please stick around. All right, I'm losing light, so I'm gonna be pretty quick and I can't be bothered to get my ring light out. So I go straight to my business binder here where I'm going to get the cash out. So as I said, 1,330 pounds. So let's just count it out. So I've got 50 and 100, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, so 950s. And then I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1000, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, so 1220. And then 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1300, 10, 1310. 15, 20, 5, and 30. So 1,330 pounds. So I just want to say a big thank you to everybody who has ordered from my Etsy shop in the last three weeks or so, because this money here is um, from, from those sales ultimately. And all of the interest that we've had, uh, both in my own binders and also in the collaboration that I've just done with Esther at My Money Matters. Um, I released some more binders last night. They've all gone. I'm hoping to release more next week and then um, potentially another release of the collaboration. Um, but it is limited edition, so we'll see if that happens. All right then, so the first envelope I'm going to start off with is my tax here. Okay, so tax today is going to get £400. So let's do that. So 51, 52, 53, 54. And we'll add that into what I already have. So altogether in tax, I now have 1,200, 1,300 in the bank. And then 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 50, 2,000, 2,050, 100, 2,120, 35. 2,135 now in my tax. All right, so now moving on to materials. I have spent quite a lot of money out of here. So let's see what I've got left. I've got one, 200 in the bank, and then 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, and 90. So 290. And today I'm gonna to be adding 585 pounds so let's do 51 52 53 54 400 20 40 60 80 500 20 40 60 5 6 80 hang on I'll just check that again 20 40 60 80 500 20 40 60 80 yeah and then 5 so 585 is being added So let's see what I've now got in materials. So I've got 200 in the bank still, and then 53, 54, 55, 56, 620, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75. So I've got 875 pounds now in my materials. Obviously I do spend out of this quite frequently. I'm trying to bring it up to a thousand so that I've got that. Um, and then I'll just top it up as I spend out of it once I've reached that goal. So that is the materials all done. And this is, if you missed my last videos, it is things uh, like laminating pouches, paper, vinyl, um, the tags that go around the binders, the binder clips, um, all the different materials that I basically use to make my binders and placeholders. 
Okay, up next we have packaging. And what have I got left in here? I've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85. <clears throat> and today it's going to get 15. So 10 and 15. So I now have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. I'm going to try and keep this at 100 all of the time. And that is for envelopes, um, the these like cellophane bags that go around the binders, stickers, thank you cards, that sort of thing. So that's that. And then next up we have postage. I'm sure I've spent out of here actually. So I've got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 in postage. And I'm going to do, I can't remember my denominations, you know. Yeah, let's do a 10 and two fives going into postage. So I now have 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. And I'm going to continue keeping this at 50 pounds. So spending out of here, I um, sent a binder to somebody for the, the collaboration. Um, and sometimes when, oh, my giveaway as well, obviously I use some postage for that. So that's when I pull out of this postage envelope. Otherwise, all of my postage is just paid, basically paid for through Etsy. Um, so that is that. So next up we have equipment. So this is basically laminators, printers, um, the Cricut machine if that ever fails. So I've got 100 in the bank currently, then 50, 70, 90, 210, no, 50, 70, 90, 200, sorry, 10, 20, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, and 70. 270 currently in equipment. And today I'm adding 130. So 50, 70, 90, 110, and 130. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130. So we'll add that in. So now in equipment, I have 100 in the bank and then 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95. Is that right? Is that messed up? 100 in the bank, 52. <laughs> 390 now in equipment. My target for this is 500 and then I'll just top it up. Okay, up next we have subscriptions. So in here I've got a number of categories. I've got Canva, I've got Amazon Prime, I've got Instant Ink, Cricut and YouTube Premium. So for today I'm going to put £20 into YouTube Premium. Just paid that it's 16 or 17 pounds a month cricket is going to get 10 so i have 10 20 30 40 45 in cricket that's a few months worth of subscription i want to try and i think you can pay that annually i'm not sure i need to, i need to check all this and then instant ink is going to get 10 i'm going to have to start paying for that from next month so in Instant Ink, I've got 20, 40, 50, and 60. Amazon is gonna get 10. I can pay that annually, so I'm just building up the money to pay for it in one payment. So I've got 20, 40, 50, 60. I think it's about, I don't know, 90, 100 quid a year. And then finally Canva. It's going to get 10 as well, so that, that's got 20, 40, 50 and 60. So the ones I can pay annually, I'll just build up the money until I've got enough and then pay it. And then the rest, I'll just pull out of this every month to pay, to pay the bill. Okay, so that is subscriptions done. And then next we have giveaways. I hope you're all well, by the way. I haven't even asked you. I've had a really, really busy week. <laughs> I've hardly watched any videos. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna, I've am gonna. i got loads to watch. Um, if I haven't got time to comment, I will like your videos. I'm, I apologise. Um, but yeah, I'm just up against it. Right. Giveaways has got 50 and I'm going to add 30. So 20 and 30. So 
So giveaways now has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. If I do reach 3000 subscribers, I'm not saying that I will, um, I'll do a big giveaway then. So yeah, that's got 80 now. And then finally in this binder, I've got my emergency fund here. So basically what I'm saving up for is if my laptop breaks, um, my, I use my iPad quite a lot for work, for my side business. So I'm just say, building up some money for that really. Um, so I've got 250 in the bank and a 50. So I've got 300 and I'm adding another 50 today. So I now have 250, 350. So 350 in emergency. And I do have an extra 10. Now I know where that's gonna go because I did have round numbers and I was a bit confused. So I mustn't have wrote down wrote it down properly. I think it should go in here in equipment. So let's do that and then count it up again. So equipment has 100 in the bank and then 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 5, 65, 75, 85, 95, 400, that's better. So 400 in equipment. All right, so that is it for the business binder. I will do a cash condensing in a couple of weeks, I think. Um, so you'll see I've got a little bit of money left over. This is the YouTube money that I got. So thank you all so much for watching my videos, for subscribing, for watching the ads. It Honestly, it means a lot. I wouldn't have this money without that. So honestly, I properly appreciate it from everyone. I really, really do. So what I'm going to do with this is rather than put it in my business, I'm going to move into my savings challenges here. And I'm actually going to top up my rainy day fund because I want to get this done before June um, so that I can buy a new iPhone and give my phone to my mom. So this is going to get £40. So in rainy day, I now have 500 in the bank and then 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60. So 660 now in rainy day, which is brilliant. And I can colour in two of these. There we go, all done. So thank you so much for getting to the end of the video. I really, really appreciate it. Again, thank you so much for everyone who has supported my shop. Um, it, honestly, I'm, like it blows my mind, it really does. Um, I'm hoping to restock, like I said, next back end of next week for my own binders. Um, so yeah, thank you so much uh, for watching the video and I shall see you in the next one. Bye.